It's almost midnight and here I am sitting in my room with some chocolate on my lips, watching K-drama, sitting on Pinterest, Instagram, YouTube, just kind of relaxing and feeling maximally lonely because my parents have gone to sleep. It seems like everyone else is also sleeping and I just, it's probably due to Corona and to all restrictions. I just want to, uh, I just want to have some company right now. I just want some person or people to watch a movie or a TV show with. Most preferably K-drama, but I don't know if someone will like to watch it with me, but if you want, please come here, text me. <laughs> I need people. And yeah, just chat, talk, relax, cuddle and warm and soft blanket, which I have over here, but I'm using it alone. <laughs> Yeah, maybe drink a bit, a bit of wine, red one, preferably right now. It'd be so nice. I just, I just went to Pinterest and saw all these cute pictures of friends, of people having fun together, celebrating birthdays. And then I'm here in my 12th year of school, the last one, having online school and seeing everyone mainly through screens. If I get lucky, I see real people, not just black screens or green boards. <laughs> yeah, a positive thought. But the other thing I wanted to talk about is, uh, I don't know how to phrase it really correctly, but, but I've noticed that, for example, yes, I do meditation often, at least I did. I haven't done it for some days. I journal. I do all this stuff. I'm used to eating quite similar foods, lots of salads and stuff, but not always. And yeah, the main point is that they are pretty similar. And and I don't know, telling myself that I need to go to sleep at this time, I don't know, at 9 or 10 p.m. and wake up not later than 8 and a.m. and all these many rules which kind of worked I don't know I did it and I was okay but after the few days when I couldn't fall asleep I was just thinking a lot and today also I was thinking a lot that maybe these maybe I don't want to really do that and I just hold myself in all these quote-unquote restrictions but although they don't feel bad but but I am so used to like you can call it self-discipline but maybe it's not maybe it's some sort of self-sabotage um yeah and I often I'm not spontaneous and don't f allow myself a room for s for some breathing and I don't know just changing things a bit and even if I do it sometimes once in a while like nothing terrible happens if I I don't know wake up and go to sleep in different time a day just will start later or earlier and like nothing much will change and and that's with many things and right now I'm thinking whether I really want to do the things I am doing all the time or have I just 
created these rules for myself and I just think that I want to do them and I think that it will be better for myself but I'm not actually listening to myself so right now I just want to take break from everything I'm doing I mean of course of course I'm not taking break for sc from school although I really want to but there is no point of that because I need to finish it and I just had a break a week ago like why <laughs> yes and but from all these little things like changing my sleeping time and and then and, and some some meals for example maybe have different snacks and in general I usually diversify breakfast but all the other meals are usually quite same and yeah usually I don't notice anything but sometimes you just need some difference you just I just yeah an important an important um suggestion is to when you're talking about yourself say not that oh sometimes you do that and that but say sometimes i do that and that because we are doing that unconsciously and we don't at least yeah see and not say we don't but i don't and i don't want to talk exactly about myself and expose myself so i'm uh, saying you usually we usually but now i'm talking about myself so i lost my thought but but yeah i need to allow myself some room to breathe listen more to myself just maybe spend some time more time with my family and just in silence really even not writing anything but just reflecting sometimes but without obsession because if you think too much it gets crazy as well Oop, too many thoughts for a night as usually as usually that's why i don't sleep because i have too much thoughts but right now i can go to sleep but i don't want to i'm just sitting here and thinking like what's the point of everything i'm doing like why why who have who has created all these habits for me mainly i have found them a long time ago and just just uh, i have found some things on internet and i listened to something to something i did not listen i ignored it and um yeah and I just took, took, took a little bit from someone thinking that if that works for them, probably I need it as well, but maybe I don't. And also, I wanted to make a video on my opinion on New Year's resolutions, but there is not much to say. I just want to mention one thing that uh, often when I see... Maybe right now it's a bit less, but uh, often when I see other people's goals, I don't want to miss out. It's like FOMO, I have a fear of missing out and I don't want to um, miss on some goals. For example, if people are writing, learn a language, I don't know, learn, I'll just say Spanish or Italian. Uh, or, I don't know, learn playing pickleball, pickleball, <laughs> how do you say that? Or, I don't know, play piano, go somewhere. And even if these goals don't really associate with myself, I don't associate them with myself, I don't need them actually, I just am fearing of missing out and, and I'm fearing of... Um, not experiencing something in my life although i don't need to experience everything but i am afraid to miss out somewhere and i'm afraid that 
it'll be too late for something for example that i'll be too old for something already and that if i haven't done it even if i haven't done something in my teenage years that in my 20s i'll be too old although i i won't be but these are my thoughts and thinking for example it's like learning dancing or maybe learning some new skills which many have learned from the young age but 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 who has invented all these things that we need to learn something only from the young age because i think it's not true we can do it anytime so i'm trying to keep myself calm I love my hair. <laughs> They're funny. Um, I'm trying to keep myself calm. And I'm telling myself that it's okay. I'm not missing something. I'm okay. I have a lot of time in my life. Nothing will pass me. I will manage to do whatever I want to. But... But it's hard. So I can go on and on, on and on, and like talk for an hour more, maybe even more. But I have already talked for nine and a half minutes. So good night, sweet dreams, and just a serious advice for you is ask yourself questions whether you really want to do something not just follow the uh i don't know some culture diet culture or anything else just just thinking that you need to do something because someone has told you that but just ask questions why what for and etc and also Remember that there's a lot of time. We will, I promise you, we, me and you, everyone, we will manage to do everything we want to. We have enough time on this earth, although it's limited, but we have time. So don't worry, just go towards your goals. Take rests when you need. Most importantly, ask questions. Why? And that is. And, of course, I'm giving these advices mainly to myself because I need to speak to someone. But I have no one right now because people are usually sleeping at night, you know. So I'm making a video about it. Okay, I hope you enjoyed my rant. And have a nice day, night, morning, whatever you have. And bye. And we haven't ended yet. From now on, in the end of my every video, I'll update you a little bit, a tiny little bit, on how am I doing with getting in shape? How am I feeling about it? How am I thinking about it? Am I moving forwards or some small, some small things, you know? just for myself, just to reflect and just to keep myself accountable. And what I'm saying is that I promise you, you, yes, you, that in the February of 2021, I don't know when exactly, but in February, I'll have reached my goal measurements for modeling and I'll get in shape for modeling. I hope it will work. I'll do all my best, everything I can, but I'm saying that so that it would be easier for me and so that so that I would know that I have told it to someone already and I have set the timeline and I just don't want to disappoint you guys and disappoint myself as well. 
So from now on, I'll keep you updated. And now really, bye.